वेलकम फ्रेंड्स दिस इज डॉक्टर प्रकाश पाटिल ब्रेन कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग बेलगावी प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल प्रेस द बेल आइकॉन सो दैट यू कैन गेट नोटिफिकेशंस लाइक द वीडियो कमेंट एंड शेयर इन सिंपल एग्जांपल ऑन रिग्रेशन लाइंस फ्रॉम दैट हाउ टू फाइंड आउट एक्स बार वाई बार स्टैंडर्ड डिविजन्स आई एम गोइंग टू डू दैट इज इन अ पार्शियली डिस्ट्रॉयड लैबोरेटरी रिकॉर्ड ऑफ अ कोरिलेशन डाटा The following results are only available. Variance in x as nine, okay, and the regression equations are available. From this data, I have to find out the mean value of x and y, standard deviation of y, and the coefficient of correlation between x and y. I have to calculate. Okay, first of all, I have to find out mean. Value of x and y. Okay, to find out that, what I will do, the regression lines, whatever the given regression lines are, the regression lines, regression lines are passing through the. Okay, they are passing through the x bar, y bar. then the regression lines satisfies those x bar y bar then regression lines regression lines satisfies x bar y bar means if i replace x by x bar and y by y bar then also the equation holds good that is 4 x bar minus 5 y bar x is replaced by x bar y is replaced by y bar equal to 33 i will write like that from the second equation i can write it as 20 x bar minus 9 y bar equal to 107 as they are satisfying the equations i can write like this okay then if i solve these two equations simultaneous equations i will get x bar and y bar how to solve them i will go to the calculator directly in equation mode Okay, equation mode option number five. First option I'll select, then four minus five, thirty-three, and second equation is twenty minus nine, hundred and seven, equal to x bar. I'm getting as three point seven one. Wait, here one mistake I've done. Plus thirty-three is there. If I shift to other side, it will become minus thirty-three. Okay, that I have not changed. Just to make that correction here. That data I will change it as minus thirty three, then equal to x equal to thirteen. Therefore, my x bar value equal to thirteen. I am getting. Similarly, y bar equal to seventeen. Okay, these are my x bar and y bar value. First question is over. Then to find out the standard deviation of y. to find standard deviation of y i have to use the uh, regression coefficients okay the <coughs> two equations i'll write in the standard form the standard form of regression lines regression lines as y equal to first equation i will write it as y equal to that is first i'll write same given equation 4x minus 5y plus 33 equal to zero. For this one, y equal to I have to write. Therefore, this is other side. Minus 5y equal to minus 4x minus 33, or just y equal to 4 by 5 plus 33 divided by 5. This is the regression line y on x. Similarly, regression line x on y. Second equation is 20x minus 9y equal to 107. Therefore, x equal to have to solve from here. 20x equal to 9y plus 107. X equal to 9 by 20y plus 107 divided by 20. Okay, this is the regression line x on y. Okay, from these two, 
regression coefficients i can write therefore regression coefficients regression coefficients b y x is nothing but 4 by 5 and b x y <coughs> is nothing but 9 by 20 using these two i can find out the standard deviation in y okay right given variance okay variance in x that is a sigma x square equal to 9 they have given that implies a sigma x is equal to 3 okay therefore b y x i can define it as b y x i can define it as r into sigma y divided by sigma x which implies sigma y is equal to um, b y x into sigma x divided by r okay that i don't know r i will find out r then i will use this to find out the this one okay how to find out r then therefore coefficient of correlation coefficient of correlation r is equal to from the regression lines it is given by b y x into b x y that is a square root of square root of 4 by 5 into 9 by 20 okay that is equal to i even can find out this one as 3 by once again i can write it as 4 ones are 4 5 are. therefore it is a square root of 9 by 25 which is equal to 3 by 5 is my r using this r i have to find out the this one b y x value i know b y x value is 4 by 5 okay and sigma x is 3 just now calculated whole divided by r is 3 by 5 and it comes out to be equal to if you reciprocate it 5 5 cancels 3 3 cancels equal to 4 is my sigma y okay like that one by one relations we should remember and then we can find out the remaining things like this some more examples on this regression lines i am going to solve in my next videos if you not yet subscribed my channel please subscribe my channel don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you'll get the notifications of my next videos like this video comment and also share this video thank you friends